Uh, we've got our patient, Master J. Master J. Master J is your nickname. Here. Oh, close, thank you. Master J, you've got a cyst on your scalp. How long you had it? Probably 10 years. 10 years, give or take. Okay. And has it ever drained or anything like that? Never. Gumby Jean has done a little bit of barbering on us uh, here. Could I have an uh, alcohol swab, please, ma'am? Yes, sir. So we are going to remove this for you today on this uh, beautiful Friday before Christmas. We had one out that we took out earlier that was just beautiful. So we're ready for uh, cyst number two. How about you? Hey, that rhymed. Right here, Gumby Jean. A little cold spray. What's he going to feel? Stick sting and a burn. There we go. Here it comes. Just like the last one. 1% 1 lidocaine with epinephrine. Going in. Nice and slow. I think you froze the needle. Sorry. Oh, you're fine. Did you feel that sting just then? Just slightly. Good. We're going in. Actually, Gumby Jean, I don't think we're going to need a, a second uh, dose I'm of medicine on this one either. No. I thought Master J was bringing us uh, a monster set. Something. Something, mm -hmm. yeah. Something that we could sell on eBay, <clears throat> you know? <laughs> But that's okay, we'll take what we've got here. Okay, we'll give it just a moment for that to work. We have 15 blade, good. So do you want to tell us all what you got your darling wife for Christmas? Uh, well, I can't even remember. Oh, we, we remember, uh, I got her, I got her, is, I got or? her a swing for our, uh, our vacation home. Oh, did you really? That's not true. And you know, it was one of those said, Easy assembly, and, ah. which means that it took about two days. Yeah, and that's always a lot. Yeah. Used to they would say some assembly required. Some assembly required. That was a little bit more food. honest, yeah. Yeah, yeah so uh, that and a couple of other uh, odds and ends. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I was worried that her mother would be coming down for Christmas. That was worrying you? Yeah, uh. kind of like that Bella, I don't know if you've heard that didn't feel good, so he went to the doctor and they ran a battery of tests on him. And the doctor came out after about three hours and said, well, I have some bad news for you. Mm -hmm. And she said, what is it? And he said, you have a rare and curable disease and only have six months to live. Mm. I think, <clears throat> yeah. Uh -huh. And the guy said, well, I guess I'll move in with my mother-in-law. <laughs> the doctor said, now why would you do that? He said, because if I've only got six it. months, I want to be the longest six months of my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not laughing at that. That's that not very, that way. was very mean. I thought that, that was, was very mean. Way. No, it was great. It was hysterical. All right, we're going to make a little incision. Are you ready? Go for we're going to be using a 15 blade for this one. Right there, that should be plenty big. We don't want to get too big with these, but we want to be sure that it's large. Did you feel anything? Nothing. You're just moving around to be moving around, aren't you? And we have our curved hemostat. And we're going to open this up a little bit so we can see Mr. Cyst. Master J and Mr. Cyst. We're very formal today, Gumby Jean. I know. I wonder why. There it is. Can you see it coming in? Mm-hmm. It's pretty cool, I think. Oh, I'm ready for the Christmas vacation. How about you? Me too. Although it's not long enough, but I can't complain because I just came back from a two-month vacation. Yeah, well, that wasn't really a vacation. I don't see. I think if you're out with back surgery, that, that doesn't really stupid. count as a vacation, does it? No, it was the worst two months. Yeah, that's no fun. I mean, vacation ought to be fun. I think there's a law. I agree. I think there's some kind of law. That, oh, you had the scissors. Good, thank you. I was reaching. Hair scissors. Those were the other ones. I was reaching for them again. So we're going to use the scissors, and we're going to just push in, and we're going to open the scissors up to sort of spread the tissue gently around the cyst, make it easier for the cyst to come out. If we start seeing gray matter, well, then you know that we went a little bit deep, right? You know what I always say, a laughing patient's a breathing patient, right? I think that's... <laughs> mm -hmm. She said I had a pulse earlier. 
Did she really? Mm -hmm. Well, that one's nice of her. Have to do Christmas shopping this weekend. Do you? I haven't done any. Oh my goodness. I don't know how much Christmas shopping I've done because I don't You don't have Christmas shop. I'm a lousy shopper. Besides, when you're married oh, to such an God. if you're married to an awesome shopper, why wouldn't you have them do the shopping, right? There's yes. that sis coming right up. A little bit of pressure there. Get that cyst up or we can see him. Look at that. Isn't that something? And tease that little pilar cyst right out. Master J, you, sir, are a connoisseur. I wouldn't say connoisseur. That'd be like a collector. You are an artiste. A renaissance man when it comes to the production of beautiful <laughs> pilar cysts. Oh, that one opened up, didn't it? Mm -hmm. This one was not as nice and clean as the other one was. Yeah, Rip. This one, though, we have a nice little squeeze out on. Look at that. Trade with me. Thank you, man. There he is, right there. Mr. Cyst. There it is. Coming out like he should. Look at that gun between. Oh. He keeps springing free. He doesn't want to come out. He likes living inside of you. Inside your head. It's nice and warm in there, apparently. You know, this time of year. That's not a bad deal, right? Okay. Sounds like Houston. Yeah, right? Did you get it? You know, he's not cooperating very well with me. He's he's uh not coming out in one piece the way I like. And that's probably because I didn't do something that I should have done or who knows what, but I'll find a way to blame myself. I'll get them all out. Don't worry about that. Look at that. Yeah, I think it was bigger than I thought. Mm. And that's why, uh, yes. bigger than it looked, right? And that's why it broke apart. Yeah, now, so we have the whole cyst. So you can see the bottom of the sack right mm -hmm. there. The top just came open. That top opened up. And I got some hair. There we go. Now we're going to come on out like we should. If you lose a piece of hair, let me know if you feel it. There we are. Yeah. And that's the whole cyst, so there's nothing left. And that was actually pretty interesting. Do I just need a wet gauze, please? Yeah. You are cyst free. That's the wet one, thank you. you. Have a smooth noggin they give? Yeah, sort of. You know, we just push on a little bit, make sure that we don't have any residual debris. We don't. And um, I'll make sure that we wipe that off. There we go. So we just have a little, can I get those curved forceps again? We just have a little piece of connective tissue there. I just want to remove it just for completion's sake. I don't think it's cyst, but let's be sure we don't leave anything behind. I see that's just connective tissue. Okay, so we're good. Let's go ahead and get our stitch in. Gummy Jean? Yes, sir. I believe he's all yours now. Let me just right. take a quick look, make sure I'm happy with that. My friend, you have successfully been desystified. <laughs> also, oh, no, 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 we'll, we'll take oh, that all off oh, real okay. quick here. And uh, right. you can have your uh, darling spouse remove these stitches from there in a week or so, or come back here if, you right. if you're bored. <laughs> yeah. All right. No okay. morning, Austin. Okay. Thank you so much. Hey folks, you've heard from hundreds of people who have benefited from Dr. Gilmore's Meta 7. I love it so much. It gives me so much energy during the day. I've noticed a change in my hair, my nails, my blood pressure. There's no doubt that it, it's, it's a benefit to me. It gives me more stamina. And you've seen celebrities and fitness experts talk about Thinergy. Thinergy, you guys are helping people lose weight. This is a shout out to the team at Thinergy. Thinergy. Thinergy.
to all the crew at the Energy. I wanted to just tell you guys to keep losing all the weight. You're doing amazing and congrats on hitting your goals. Now it's time to pick up the ultimate weight loss pack, Finergy and Meta 7 together. Activate your life with more energy from Meta 7, then curb your appetite and burn those calories with Finergy. Check out the Amazon links below and start losing weight today.